Okay, let's go to Zardus. Okay, now let's just quickly get go up this ladder. Yes, I'm so happy. Now let's talk to him. I have found a way into the underground temple. You have? That's remarkable. You have become very powerful. Stronger than anybody else inside the barrier. Maybe you really are the man the orcish prophecies told of. Prophecies? What prophecies? Ancient orcish documents written shortly after the sealing of the underground temple mention a holy foe. A holy foe? Someone who shall come to drive the sleeper from our world forever. I am supposed to be the one mentioned in the ancient prophecies? You must be wrong, surely. Maybe, maybe not. I found this strange sword. Show it to me. That's interesting. It has Eurizio written on it. I've heard of this sword. It's a weapon from the olden days, when the human race was still young. The weapon was forged from an unknown material, and there's nothing written about who created it. This blade was said to possess unbelievable powers, but I don't notice any magical aura. Eurizio possessed unbelievable powers? It was written that the owner of the weapon was able to pierce the strongest armor and to overcome even the most powerful of protection spells. How could the orcs get this powerful weapon into their hands? It's claimed that the orcs took it from a powerful warlord. They didn't know how to use it, but they did hide it. But they didn't hide it well enough. Is it possible to restore the former powers of the weapon? You need a very strong magical source of power for that purpose. You mean strong enough to detonate the magic barrier with? About that strong. Besides, You'll need a very special magic formula in order to transfer the power. Give me some time, and I'll create the magic formula. Meanwhile, I'll be hunting around for better armor. These patchwork minecrawler plates have been pierced too often in the underground temple. You should go to my old tower. Your old tower? It sank below one of the eastern lakes during one of the earthquakes. The spires are still visible above the surface. There are still some artifacts inside it. I never made any effort to salvage them. How do I get there? I haven't been there since the earthquake, which means you'll have to find a way to enter it yourself. But take this key. It opens a chest in which I used to store some particularly rare artifacts. Six circle magic? 40 skill points? Just wait, I want to see what would happen if I do become... Well, very powerful at magic. Just like that. Can you teach me? Not yet. You have the skill, but you're not experienced enough. Let Satyrus train you first. I shall instruct you at Okay, well, let's... Um, hmm. I guess I'm gonna have to go to Zardus's old tower. But not right now. I'm just quickly gonna go back to Satyrus. Maybe he has something to say. Maybe I'm not. glad you've joined us. I'm injured. Can you heal me? Through my words, I call to and spirit shall be well. Shoot. Okay, let's see what he has. Oh my god. So many potions. Okay, well. That's fine. Let's talk to Satyrus. What? If you're injured. No shit. Let's talk to Satyrus. For the honor of me. Never mind. May you return. Okay. There's one final thing I'm gonna do. Before I begin the next episode, which will be... Well, later, I guess. <laughs> um, I'm going to... Uh, where the hell is this? Okay. Now let's...
that sock to Lee. May I pass through here? No. Hello. Okay. Oh wait. I have to go to Laris, not him. Okay, so let's go to Laris. <sighs> wow, this was probably the longest episode I've ever done in my life. Kind of amazing. Okay, let's go over here. Now let's talk to Laris. You're at the Okay, fair enough. Now, I've got a hundred strength and a hundred dexterity. Unbelievable! Wow. Okay. Now I have nothing else to do except get the ring of strength. Actually, screw that. Oh no, I'll put it for now. A little of power. Uh what's this? Ring of greater invincibility? Holy crap. That's pretty badass. Okay, I... Well, this is the end of the episode. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Wow, this was long. Have fun, and right now...